Hello YouTube, Themper Mobius here with another new Austin update. In this video, we'll be looking at the second major faction of the new Austin area. Universe City, or just Univer, is the second major faction of New Austin. This faction was built up by the remnants of the University of Texas and its residents. Today we'll be focusing on the different items used by peacekeepers and warriors of Univer. Starting off with the Longhorn Knight's Outfits. This is a traditional outfit worn by the Univer Knights during patrol and to show their allegiance during stadium games. As the player, you'll be able to customize both the numbers on the front and back, the symbol on the chest, and most importantly, the name on the back. Assuming, of course, you are great enough to join their ranks. Another important piece of gear is the Univer Knight's helmets. These helmets are passed down from before the war, being adorned with different trophies and gear to differentiate the knights from one another, each having their own meaning and each being unique to the wearer. As the player, you too will be able to adorn these helmets, change their colors, and enhance them in a variety of ways. Although knights are trained in a variety of weapons, on the stadium field, they usually choose to use the Power Fist. This Power Fist uses fusion cells and was developed many years after the Great War. With this Power Fist, many new and interesting mods have been made to change its behavior. But we will look into those mods into the future. Along with the Univer Knights, Univer is protected by the technologically enhanced Riflemen. These Riflemen wear a vest, developed by the scientists of Univer that enhances the user's perception massively. The vest takes in a huge amount of data from atmospheric composition, infrared imaging, air currents, and more, fitting this information into a portable computer worn on the back. This computer will feed this information back to the user via a augmented reality headset allowing the user to experience a heightened awareness, allowing them a much greater reaction time compared to others, marking potential enemies as well as marking places of interest for the user. One of the best offensive tools of Univer, for sure. Pit-Boys have always been important for post-apocalyptic life, but after 300 years, they are starting to become rare. Univer, understanding the many advantages of carrying one, has begun cloning the technology, making them available for much wider use. With these new Pit-Boys, it is possible to switch out many of the components for better ones. As the player, you'll find unique components while shopping around, or looting the dead. The last piece of Univer gear we'll be looking at is the new laser musket. This laser musket was developed after Univer scientists got a hold of the original. Seeing the potential of this kind of rifle, it was developed into a full functioning production product. Along with the rifle, several modifications were also produced, from muzzle attachments to rifle stocks and grips. 
As the player, you'll have many interesting customizations for all the weapons of New Austin. Well, that's all we have to talk about today, but if you stick around, I have something huge to show you. Thank you for watching, though. Work on New Austin will be slow at first as the world is designed and mapped out, but is constantly being worked on. So thank you for watching. The more people that watch and interact, the more I'm energized to work on it. Remember to like the video, share the video with anyone who loves Fallout, and subscribe for more updates. Now for something very special. Please enjoy this little segment of the new Laser Musket, working in-game and available now. Excellent. City surplus, everything you need. Perfection. May the divide bring you peace. May the glow of Adam guide your path. 